Good evening and welcome to the 11th MHRA Annual Lecture. It is indeed an honour and a pleasure to deliver the 2016 MHRA Annual Lecture. The world has changed dramatically. Our world is profoundly interconnected. The explosive spread of Zika shattered the notion that a disease long considered a medical curiosity will stay that way. Chronic non-communicable diseases have overtaken infectious diseases as the number one killers worldwide. It was an amazing lecture. She covered such a broad spectrum of topics on a global basis. Absolutely inspiring. It was uh, full of contemporary issues. What really stood out for me was the recognition from Dr Chan for the work of MHRA and NIPS. You are a global leader. A global leader in assuring the quality of vaccines and other biological medicines. Work done by this MHRA quietly and effectively protects millions of people every day in multiple ways. The most important and powerful message across was the extent to which as humans we are extremely vulnerable and unless we are prepared to work together we will not tackle some of the big issues. It's really clear that regulators need to work together, but also about sort of working together with industry. The point that stood out to me is the whole point about prevention being better than cure. Public confidence in the quality and safety of medical products translates into confidence in the national health services and, of course, confidence in the government's commitment to protect its public. Hopefully the MHRA can use its influence really effectively to actually encourage uh, countries to work together more to, to tackle these kind of uh, problems that we have with um, antibiotic resistance, etc. In an era of global health perils, we need to let our imaginations soar when looking for ways to get quality medical products to those in greatest need.